Happy holidays, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. And if you are new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. Now, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell for more upcoming future videos. For this DIY, I made three holiday decor pillows for gifts and I would like to share with you how I made them. Just continue watching. To start off, I'll be using this crushed velvet blue material that I had left over from a previous project. Next, I'll be marking and cutting 10 by 30 inches. I will have a complete list of all items used in the description bar below. Next, I will flip the fabric over and fold it in half and then I will start gluing the edges using hot glue. Once you get to the top, make sure you leave enough space for your hand to fit so you may insert the stuff in. Once you're done, flip the fabric inside out. Next, I purchased a standard pillow from Walmart and I'll be using the stuffing. Next, to close it up, I just folded the corners and added hot glue. Next, I took white crushed velvet fabric and I'll be laying the pillow on top and cutting it to size the corners of the pillow. This is the only part in the entire video where I'll be using a needle and a thread and it's only to fringe out the corners of the fabric. Once I have my correct measurements, I'll flip the fabric over and start gluing on the edges using hot glue. Next, I will pinch the fabric in the center and I'll glue it with hot glue. And now I have a bowl. Next, I'll take diamond wrap and glue it in the center. I apologize for my camera being upside down, but here I've just basically glued on some loose assorted diamond gems. For project number two, I purchased these shower curtains with an interesting pattern from Walmart and this is what I'll be working with. Once I cut it to size, I'll be using the lighter just to seal off the edges and I'll be using it very lightly. And before starting any projects, just make sure you iron your fabric. 
Next, I'll be using this 16 inch platter and I'll be tracing two circles and cutting them out. Here I'll be repeating the same steps from the first DIY and gluing the edges with hot glue. Next, I'll be using these faux fur pom-poms in assorted colors and assorted sizes, and I'll be using hot glue to glue them on the edges of the pillow. I glue small pom-poms around the front part of the pillow. For DIY number three, I purchased this beautiful shiny black fabric from Walmart and this is what I'll be using in this project. I'll be repeating the same steps from gluing and stuffing. Next, I'll be using this metallic silver fabric that I purchased from Walmart and I'll be cutting it to size the pillow. Next, I'll be taking the edges of the fabric and I'll be bringing it up and I'll be tying it this time to the side of the pillow. I will cut off the excess of the fabric and then I'll be using hot glue to glue it down. Here I'm just folding all the edges in. I'll be gluing the remaining edges down to the seam of the pillow for a metallic finish on the back side of the pillow. I glued gem wrap around the knot and I also glued on single strands of gem wrap around the edges where I glued down the silver fabric. I also use assorted gems and glue them around the knot area. And here is the finished look. For video purposes only, I'm only showing you one pillow of each style, but I actually made two of each. I really do love the way these decor pillows turned out and they are the perfect style and color for the loved ones that I chose in it as a gift. Leave a comment down below of which pillow might be your favorite. This is the perfect gift for a loved one or for yourself to glam up your home.
and only for less than $10 to make two, this will be the perfect gift. I hope I've given you great gift ideas and you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoy making it. Now don't forget, I post new DIY videos every week. Like and share with family and friends. Comment if you wish. Subscribe if you haven't. Click on the notification bell for more upcoming future videos. See you soon.